Lou! Yeah. No, no, there's a giant pike here. Blind. So this year I got a big caster set up. It's the Daiwa Tatula CT reel. And I have 20 pound Daiwa J Braid X8 on there. And the rod I got is a Daiwa Air X, seven foot medium heavy. You know, I've been uh, practicing casting this reel for, I'd say three days now, I'm trying to get ready for the fishing season opener on May 5th. I, I think I got a dial, okay? So the Mac 4 style is at four, and I'm casting this, uh, this 3 8 ounce hair jig. Just gonna show you a cast. Oh, there we go, it went to the left. <laughs> Uh, I'm still not very good at controlling the direction, but I'm not getting bird nests, so there we go, that's better. So, you know, that's easily 30 meters. That's a better cast. So, you know what? I think I'm ready for opener. I can't wait to catch my first fish on the bait caster, guys. So, stay tuned. Let's go, it's go time. Good morning guys, welcome back to T10 Outdoors. The day has finally come. Today is May 5th. Now it's 5.40 in the morning and I'm just super pumped, super excited for today because today is Saskatchewan fishing opener. Well, first thing first, I'm gonna go trap some leeches. So yeah, I'll see you by the pond. First trap. What do we got here? Oh yeah, we got a few, hey? Look at that one. Nice. Second trap, not as many. This one had a, a two perch heads. And looks like just the one. That one's pretty decent. Look at that. That's what you get from the store. Third trap, again with two perch heads. Oh, there's a big one. Yeah, there's, a, there's just one big one. Look at that leech. Ooh. Trap four. Walleye head. But only three little ones. I'll probably take this one and throw the other ones back. But I think they like the walleye head better. And then uh, the other side of the pond produces better. So I'm, I'm going to concentrate on the other side in the future. But yeah, that's it. Look at all of them. I probably have 20 to 30 leeches in there. All decent size, some really fat ones right there. And you know, I think that's enough leeches for a weekend, a couple days, and that's good enough for me. So yeah, I'm gonna go, go home and pack up and get on the road to Last Mountain Lake. So stay tuned. All right guys, I just arrived at Regina Beach. Just parked my vehicle and uh, got everything in this little cart. My bag, net, rods, everything's super handy. I'm kind of surprised there's not very many people at the pier. I talked to a guy and uh, he said he didn't catch anything. So <laughs> maybe the fish is not here yet, but I'm gonna go over there to the point and uh, cause I'm in my waders, I can walk in and I did the same thing uh, last spring and it did pretty well, so I'm very uh, optimistic. Uh, can't wait to get that first cast in and yeah, it's a beautiful day. It's going to get to 27 degrees. My go-to combo, this is the Old Man Black, 7 foot uh, medium light. I got it paired with a Daiwa Legalis LT, this is a 2021 model. I did a review on this uh, reel, you can go check it out. Starting off with a jig head and a kite tech paddle tail swim bait all right wow <laughs> that is awesome man okay there's some wind i'm just gonna work it slowly is that that's that's the bottom that's weeds 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 so lots of weeds weed party man 
too much weeds. I think uh, might switch it to a crankbait. Okay, I didn't have too much luck with uh, paddle tail and jig. I'm gonna try a jerk bait. This one is a shallow diver. So uh, this way it doesn't get into the weeds. Ready to row again. Oh, I'm hooked. Fishing is not easy. Oh yeah, nice cast. Yeah, I love that diving action. All you need to do, just retrieve it. Sometimes give it a jerk. Pause, make sure you pause. There's a suspending bait. So giving the fish some time to take it. Good thing you didn't miss much. There's, there's no reaction. <laughs> oh, you got the new combo there. Huh? You got the new combo there. Yeah. Looks sick, man. I like it. See, I wrap my cork. Oh, nice. Because it's kind of deteriorating. Yeah. All right, first cast on the new rod. How, how far do you go? Oh, you just go, man. Just go slowly. Okay, Until you. you... Get I don't know, man. I'm gonna I'm gonna change my bait because this one's uh, kicking too much bottom. Which one do I use? I caught a bunch on live target last season. You know what? I'm gonna give this one a try. But if there's no fish, there's no fish. No matter what kind of bait you use. Can't remember which day last year I was fishing here. It was not opening day. It was like maybe a couple days later. I think. Yeah. It's not like the day, it's like the temperature of the water. That matters. Yeah. Well, it's, it's going to be a hot day, but it, it, we had a cold spring. So. Yeah. So I would say maybe two more weeks. Two more weeks. How long have you been fishing now? An hour? Yeah, an hour. Nothing. Eh? Just casting jig heads, paddle tail, crankbait, swim bait, no reaction. <laughs> But I mean, the, the water was kind of wavy. Okay. It's better now. It's getting warmer. It was kind of yeah, chilly yeah. in the morning. So. That's good. Yeah. Maybe this like afternoon will hammer. Yeah. I know another spot just over there. Yeah, I think that's that's gonna be better. Cause the fish are the fish move from, you know, the east side. To Last Mountain Lake, right? Yeah. Maybe they haven't got here yet. I was gonna go to uh, Buffalo Town again. Mm -hmm. I feel like pikes are, pikes are gonna be there. Cause there's current, it's right by the mouth, right? Yeah, yeah. big pike. <sighs> I'm start, starting to think this is a, not the best decision. <laughs> so, next time I'm gonna make my own decision. <laughs> All right, folks, guess what? We couldn't catch anything at Regina Beach, so. We're here at the dam, Buffalo Pound Dam. I don't mind catching pike, I just want to catch something. So let's get it. CRB jig. Oh, you can see minnows. They saw a big pike there. They saw a big pike? Yeah. Oh yeah. I feel good. What do you have? Uh, jig and paddle tail. Oh, same area. My color. My, your color? Yeah. I have my color. Dude, this looks good. I know. We have to catch something. Yeah. It might be slow right now, but we'll, we'll catch something. I'm sure we'll catch something. Oh yeah, look at that. Big swim bait. Looks like a walleye. Maybe the, the pike will take a swipe at it. You know what? I'm going to tie a leader on just in case. Yeah, for sure. All right, first cast. See how he swims. Oh yeah, pretty good.
Lou, Lou! Oh! Came off! Came off! Pike, I think Pike. It's right here. Oh! Dude! Oh, man! I don't know how to have set the I just lift up. Maybe there was no good hook set. Yeah. Well, that thing is big, right? Yeah. I let it took it. I let it bite it for like three times. Good. I felt it. Boom, boom, boom. They're here, man. <laughs> Lou. No, no, there's a giant pike here. Blind. No, it's right here. Like, oh my goodness. It's swimming towards you. Giant pike. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Retrieve, retrieve. It's blind. I think it's blind. blind. Yeah, it's blind. Holy smokes. No, it, it went back down. It just came right up to me, like right here. Really? Yeah. 40, around 40, I think. 40, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, Tom. It doesn't look healthy. It's, it's thick, but the, the eyes are like white. Somebody, somebody probably held it in the eyeball. Probably, hey? Yeah. I think it didn't know where to go. Oh. Pike. Oh, yeah. Yeah. nice! Nice! Same bait as yours. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I got hit. Oh, you have fire? Yeah. You would just take me from the all the way over here. Right. <laughs> 50, 50 inch. Uh, 45 at least. Yeah, let's not exaggerate. <laughs> oh my goodness, I got two pikes following me. Right there. Right there. Two little ones. So here's what I'm using. This is a jointed hard swim bait I got from AliExpress. I don't know, it kind of mimics a bait fish, a bigger size bait fish. So yeah, it's got a really nice action in the water. Um, we haven't caught a fish whole day. We saw people catching fish. I even saw a giant 40 inch carp, I mean 40 inch pike, uh, right in the water in front of me. They're here, you know, they're definitely here. Just need to trigger them to bite now. You might need to pull out that big swim bait. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. Here we go. Another big jointed swim bait, hard bait, I bought from China. And I uh, think it should trigger them. Wow. And it casts super easily because it's heavy. On a big caster wow look at that that is a that is awesome look at that action that is nice Did that thing float? dude look at look at this action Did it float? uh it i don't think it's i think it's oh, slow think. yeah oh, but, slow oh, wow wow look at that that looks like a pike swimming yeah i have a pike on now <laughs> They will oh, eat that too, yeah. But it's way less action though. Yeah. We'll see. Oh yeah. Just one fish. I like that sound. <laughs> it's like a frog, eh? Oh, oh, there we go. Lou, Lou, Lou. Oh. Oh, I scared it. Another follow. Follow me? 
No, no, my, me. <laughs> oh. Dude, that thing is good. Yeah. That one's really good for like shore fishing with jigs. There it is. Weight. There it is. See that? It turned around. Oh, it turned around. Another follow big? Yeah. Small? There's this ledge here. It gets too shallow. That okay. if they don't bite and you reel in, they're just going to turn around. Another follow. And turn around. And turn around. Turn around. Oh my goodness. Rejected five times. Oh. Yeah. Tell me Zong. Oh, that's big. Oh my goodness. Okay, Tom, fight the fish, fight the fish. Oh, Cat, let's. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it going. Yeah. All right, at the end of the day, big pike. Oh my goodness. Came that's uh, that's mid 30, high 30. Probably. Okay, let's use Finally. this. Ooh. Powerful. Oh. Where are you gonna land it? I'll, I'll go come to this side. Eh? All right, we got Tom here. Unfortunately, I'm not getting any of that footage on my GoPro. Look at this net, bro. Oh <laughs> this net is God, so God, good. Man. I can't even see the bait. He inhaled it. That's a big bait. It's gone, man. Okay. That's 40. That's 40? Uh, pushing, yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, he's bleeding. <laughs> Oh, that back one. Look at that. You're gonna get it. There we go. Here, do you want to just retie? Yeah, yeah, just cut it. Just cut it. There we go. Uh, you can drop the pipe. You want a picture, right? Yeah, yeah. Alright, check this fish out. Nice fish. I missed all the footage, but that's fine. Ready? Look at that fish. <laughs> Look at that fish. Get a, get a measurement on him. Yeah. Oh, that's long. Oh, yeah, it's 40. It's 40. 41, right there. Hey, Dawson, 41. Is it longer? That's okay. a long fish. 41 Ooh. and three quarters. 41 and three quarters, okay. <sighs> Look at that fish, guys. Finally. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> All right, Tom. One, two, three. One, two, three. Oh, look at the head on him. Look at that fish, man. Hey, it's probably a she, eh? Probably a she. It's okay. bleeding. Let's, let's one, just... One, two, three. One. Okay, that's good. All right. We're putting the net. Get her release on this big girl. Oh. <clears throat> Woo! <laughs> Dude. Nice. Good job, man. Good job. All right, yeah. Get, get a release on her. Okay. Maybe help her out a bit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's the one been following you all day. Probably, eh? Wow, just a torpedo. I got its tail. He didn't fight too much, eh? No. Not at all. Maybe tired from spawning? Yeah, I would say. Look at the, look at the marks. Yeah. Look at the He's beat up, right? Yeah. Bite marks. What oh. the heck? Look at that. Is it yeah, fight it. Or fight marks. Right? Yeah, we're just spawning on the rocks, maybe. Right. I don't know. Forty-one and three quarters. Oh man. Oh. There she goes. There she goes slowly. That fish is old. She's probably like twenty years old. Have you seen? Like, like it's not as big as those past one ones, but the head is so big. Yeah. Like it's. This one is skinny. Like. That pre-spawn it would be so big. Yeah. It's post-spawn, right? That's why it's, it's post-spawn. All right, guys, you're looking at a man who is defeated for almost 12 hours. But finally, I caught a fish. Not a small one either. And on top of that, it was my first fish ever on the bay caster. It felt so good, man. I think bait caster will be uh, used quite a bit this summer. 
especially for big pike bait. So that right there is the Daiwa Tatula CT. And the rod I use is a Daiwa Air Axe, seven foot medium heavy. I think it's, it's a good skill to learn the bait caster. And yeah, man, pretty happy about today. I'm totally tired. So <laughs> that was my first day of uh, open water fishing in 2022. So stay tuned, there's gonna be more coming up to you on T-Tain Outdoors.